Chapter on the meaning of every child is born in a state of fitrah and the ruling on the dead children of the disbelievers and of the Muslims. It was narrated from Abu Huraira that he used to say, the Messenger of Allah peace be upon him said, there is no child who is not born in a state of fitrah. Then his parents make him a Jew or a Christian or a Magian, just as animals bring forth animals with their limbs intact. Do you see any deformed one among them? Then Abu Huraira said, Recite if you wish, Allah's fitrah with which he has created mankind. No change let there be in khalqillah. Quran, Surah al rum Chapter 30, Verse 30 It was narrated from Az-Zuhri with this chain of narrators, a hadith similar to hadith number 6755, and he said, As animals bring forth other animals, and he did not say with their limbs intact. Abu Huraira narrated that the Messenger of Allah peace be upon him said, There is no child who is not born in a state of fitrah. Then he said, Recite Allah's fitrah with which he has created mankind. No change let there be in khalqillah. That is the straight religion. Quran, Surah Al-Rum, Chapter 30, Verse 30 it was narrated that Abu Huraira said, The Messenger of Allah peace be upon him said, There is no child who is not born in a state of fitrah. Then his parents make him a Jew or a Christian or an idolater. A man said, O Messenger of Allah, what do you think if he dies before that? He said, Allah knows best what they would have done. It was narrated from Al-A'mash with this chain of narrators a hadith similar to hadith number 6758. In the hadith of Ibn Numair, it says, There is no child who is born but upon this millah. In the report of Abu Bakr from Abu Muawiyah, upon this millah, until he starts to speak. In the report of Abu Quraib from Abu Muawiyah, there is no child who is not born in a state of fitrah until he begins to speak. It was narrated that Hammam ibn Munabbih said, This is what Abu Huraira narrated to us from the Messenger of Allah peace be upon him. And he mentioned a number of ahadith, including the following. The Messenger of Allah peace be upon him said, Everyone who is born, is born in this state of fitrah. Then his parents make him a Jew or a Christian, just as camels are bred. Do you see any deformed one among them? Until you are the one who cuts their ears, noses, tails, etc. They said, O Messenger of Allah, what do you think of one who dies in childhood? He said, Allah knows best what they would have done. It was narrated from Abu Huraira that the Messenger of Allah peace be upon him said, Every person is born by his mother in a state of fitrah, after which his parents make him a Jew or a Christian or a Magian. Or if they are Muslim, they make him a Muslim. Every person who is born by his mother is struck on his side by the shaitan, except for Maryam and her son. It was narrated from Abu Huraira that the Messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, was asked about the children of the idolaters. He said, Allah knows best what they would have done. A similar hadith as hadith number 6762 was narrated from Az-Zuhri with the chain of narrators of Yunus and Ibn Abi Dhib, except that in the hadith of Shu'ib and Ma'qil it says, he was asked about the offspring of the idolaters. It was narrated that Abu Huraira said, the Messenger of Allah peace be upon him was asked about the children of the idolaters who die in infancy. He said, Allah knows best what they would have done. It was narrated that Ibn Abbas said, The Messenger of Allah peace be upon him was asked about the children of the idolaters. He said, Allah knows best what they would have done, as he created them. It was narrated that Ubay ibn Ka'ab said, The Messenger of Allah peace be upon him said, The boy who was killed by Al-Khidr was decreed to be a disbeliever. Had he lived, he would have oppressed his parents by rebellion and disbelief. 
Footnote See Quran Surah Al-Kahf Chapter 18 Verse 80 And Hadith Number 6163 It was narrated that Aisha, the mother of the believers, said, A boy died and I said, Glad tidings for him, one of the little birds of paradise. The Messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, said, Do you not know that Allah created paradise and the fire, and he created people for one and people for the other? It was narrated that Aisha, the mother of the believers, said, The Messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, was called to the funeral of an Ansari boy, and I said, O Messenger of Allah, glad tidings for this boy, one of the little birds of paradise. He did not do any evil or reach the age of doing evil. He said, It may be otherwise, O Aisha, for Allah created people for paradise. He created them for it when they were in their father's loins. And he created people for the fire. He created them for it when they were in their father's loins. A similar hadith as hadith number 6768 was narrated from Talha ibn Yahya with the chain of Waqiyah.